Alright, time to roll out yet again for another day of shooting. It's apparently significantly colder out today, but uh, whatever. Uh, as you might be able to tell by the fact that there's this branch of a um, tree, probably from over there. Yeah, it's uh, certainly stormy last night. This apparently fell down. I mean, but the hail should have been an indication. That branch. You know, it's not that cold, but it's windy. I might have to go stop up and uh, get, a, get a real jacket. Oh, well. I need to leave. As I was saying yesterday, all this is still in the back. Yeah, I'm going to go get a jacket. Okay, that's better. And uh, we're ready to rock and roll. Now, one thing uh, that's different today is that we're actually going back to New Jersey today. Back to uh, one of our original locations. Not outside, thankfully. So, anything the weather wants to throw at us today will be... Uh, pretty much invalidated. Also, look at that giant branch over by the, the yard seat over there. Can you see that? I think you can. Yeah, that, if you saw it. Certainly, uh, certainly was windy and hailing last night as uh, evidenced by the fact that we had to clear out. But yeah, so plan is, as always, meeting people at you cross. Uh, there's lunch at 11, but call isn't actually until 11.30, so um, I have 40 minutes to get down there for lunch, and I kind of need to eat, so yeah, but I was like tired and running late and all that fun stuff. Also, I let my phone die last night, which is something that I don't do very often when I start shopping cart all the way out of here. Anyway, I'm just gonna go off to Ucross. Meet you guys down there. <laughs> well, we don't care. Uh, <laughs> I'm just uh, spit my soul everywhere. Uh, uh, yeah, I'm Yeah, no, I, I noticed that, but I had told you last night. Yeah, I think she's smart enough, huh? <laughs> I don't think she probably. Oh, there he is. Oh, that is 29, damn. One more minute! Oh. Nice! Alright, here. Hey look, we're on set. We're sending this place back up again. Back to be more sound operations. Yep, and I got a haircut. Yeah, from the last time. So, because we, we didn't really regroup last night, all of this stuff is still kind of mixed up, so we're sifting that out, right, Dan? Oh, uh, yeah, man. No, it's this house, isn't it? You just gotta ask me right, Dan, if it's in this house. But thankfully, we have time to do that, so yep. it's gonna be okay. Yeah. Alright, time to restage all of our sound gear. Yep. Yeah, do it. You gotta love this guy. There really is no one else in this planet like him. If I keep pointing this at you, how long will you stay like this? Which foot do I hop on to now the second time? Yeah, right. It does. Hop, step, hop. The second one, so yeah, hop, step. Hop, one, hop, two. Step. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're doing things. Huh? <laughs> no. Uh, like my, my ankle can barely handle it. Are you teaching? I was what? teaching. <laughs> he asked me yesterday. He wants to be close to his teacher. Right, Dan? You're right. Okay. Okay. This is a standing ovation too while I was sitting down and I stood up. <laughs> I may have had a good state warning at all. Mm. Side. 
watching. Yeah. Damn. 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 <laughs> it jumped off Another my one. hand because it didn't like the result. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Martina pushed me off the <laughs> ground. <laughs> oh. Uh, Dan lost a bunch of coin flips in a row. No, I didn't. I, I well, was it up to best like well, 10 well, out of 21? Well, the thing was, if I got if I got heads, then I had to jump off this railing. If I got tails, then I didn't. Well, shit. Well, so it was that, and they got we got what nine heads in a row, and then one tails. But then it's been heads ever since. <laughs> Apparently not. Apparently there's been. Hey tails! Hey, I'm doing better. Someone's looking out for me. Heads. <laughs> Oh damn! Because you're back in your spot. Yeah. My first. My first round. I feel like the world just wants to be entertained by me turning into a pancake and jumping off of the railing. Think about it. If I was a little. Dan, where's the nearest hospital on your call sheet? Oh, it's like around the corner. If I was, if I was a little bit shorter, think of all the stuff I could do. I could fit under uh, like tall things. I wouldn't have to worry about exit signs, even if they like were like strung by their thing and like hanging super low. Cause I'd be like the one in you cross. Yeah, like that one. So really, jumping off the edge and flattening myself is the best scenario. All right, how about we just do one? Like this is like take it or leave it. Like this is like the toss. Okay, you toss it. Whoo, <laughs> tails! I'm living, boys. Living. There we go. <laughs> Alright, uh, okay. I'll go. Right. Do you want to demonstrate or should I demonstrate? Alright, welcome back to Dabbing 101. <laughs> I, I'm your host, Dabtastic. <laughs> Today, we're going to teach you how to dab like you've never dipped before. Um, so, Michael, do you want to uh, take a look? Take a, take a uh, give him give him a radius. We need at least a three foot radius for this to uh, properly, okay. properly work. So when you down, it's a very simple technique. Take your arms and you sneeze like this. That's it. But you have to have a little bit of rhythm and like a little bit of a oomph to it. And so when you do it, it has to be like. <laughs> and, 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 and you can you can, you can add a couple things to it, yeah. but like the main move is just it's all about the player. Honestly, I believe yeah. the faster you do it, the better. Like the less the yeah. less dab yeah. window you have, the more the more worth it is for that amount of time. That motion. So if you're just like <laughs> he's right, and then you're done. You know, it's really quick, uh, and that's that's how you 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 get the women. <laughs> is that what it is? Yeah. That's work? the secret? Did it work for yeah. you, Seamus? All, all you have to do is dab in their direction and then... Yeah. No, I don't think... It's a mating call. It's a mating call, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's like, like peacocking, each feather of a peacock is just a dab arm. <laughs> <laughs> it's the greatest analogy I've heard all day, yeah. honestly. <laughs> so, <laughs> think about that. Remember, dabs are like peacocks. You can't have too many, and sometimes they're annoying. <laughs> <laughs> I, I gotta leave. <laughs> I gotta leave. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much. I've been being here for a few hours now. Alright, jo join us next week where we, we teach you how to do the cha cha slide. <laughs> cha cha slide. Oh, uh, we're gonna actually have to. We probably will actually have right, to. Alright, no, we're, we're gonna have to meet up next week and we're gonna. Like, have just to, for that. Just, just to teach. Teach the, the audience at home how to do the cha cha slide. I feel like first we have to teach them how to whip it. No, whip, they're not ready for the whip in the That's, that's, that's the panty drop, and we gotta save that for last. power would you rather have? You can jump as high as you want to, but as far as you want to. And but as high you, as you want to. Well, yes, but your, but your legs break when you land. Or, they like shatter like glass. Well, what happens power. when I just like or, jump normally, though? Or, you have... Uh, lasers that shoot out of your fingertips uh, at random nice. intervals that you can't control. That's are they just visual lasers or are they like burning I lasers? Like, I feel like what I would do, no, what I would do, I would get the jumping one and then just always land in the ocean. No, they just still jump. break. Yeah. No. Well, wait, Why yes. no. Why? So I could land in like pillows and they still break. Yes, as soon as you jump, 
Like, your legs what if would... I just wanted to do like that? What if I just wanted to jump normally? Yes, yeah, they would shatter. shatter. So but I can't the, jump. The bright side is, it would only take like two weeks to regenerate your legs. That's two weeks. Week regeneration. <laughs> like, like, but then I'd have to jump into a hospital like, every your time. Bones, your bones would shatter. I would it would to, take two weeks would, to regenerate, but it still hurts like... I would have to drive around and plant wheelchairs in various locations, and then I can like warp there, but then I have my wheelchair warp. that I can... See, someone has tried to get around that superpower by, well, what if I just jumped onto the, you know, jumped up a skyscraper and grabbed onto the ledge? The legs would still break. <laughs> Wait a minute. Would they break when I catch there, or when yes, I Yes, because of the because of the force of your hand going through back. your entire body, they that, would still shatter. I don't think you know how physics your works. Your bones are made of glass. My bones are made of glass. Are in they see legs. through though? It doesn't matter. I mean, you still have no, skin in it. No, can I can I see through my legs? No, you question? can't. Then no, it's not worth it. If I could see <laughs> through it, then except <laughs> the laser fingers, they have it at random intervals and they hurt. i like so bad. Wait, they whenever hurt, like, this do started they get shot out. Other people. This yeah, started out as like a superpower. These like, are just they, all, they're superpowers. These are not superpowers. Does it hurt me when they shoot out of my fingers? Yes, but and it can also happen when you're sleeping. Well, can, can I wear gloves that like, can I wear like heat gloves that like keep them in? I mean, they go straight through. Well, I always wanted fingerless gloves. Is it like a Cyclops type deal from X-Men, you know? Just like... Yeah. But can I put shades I mean, on my hands? Like a, can I have sunglasses for hands? I mean... Shades well, on your hands? <laughs> if you invent something, maybe. <laughs> Alright, get back to me in two years. I'll have an invention. And then if not, I'll go with the lights. You still haven't chosen. You, you chose the laser hands? Uh... If I can invent- no, I'll go with the legs. Honestly, I think it'll be worth it, and it'll be really funny when I like accidentally jump and break my legs. Right, because you don't have to jump. Because I'll get used to, I'll get used to my legs But then broken, it gets to the point so where just, you could have like a robotic yeah, exoskeleton yeah. that when you jump, you can still walk around. But, but, can I break my leg? can I still jump when my legs are broken? No. Why? It's a one jump thing, your legs break, oh and then they regenerate. <laughs> And then no, but you can why jump can't? Again. Why can't? Does the what happens? Come with the legs? Well, because they hurt too much. But what why would you want to jump on broken legs? Be because I want. Because why would you not want to do that? <laughs> if Wait, they're already if they're already broken, you can't break them more. So this is yeah, what yes, happens when we're see if you do it too many times as a session, the bones disintegrate, and yeah, you all have that, you will have meat lumps. For legs. <laughs> hey, yeah, girls are into really it. Who are you calling? Right? Right? Can I still jump, jump really high, high with the meat legs? <laughs> no. <laughs> why not? The bones are the things that give you the superpower. But then why do they break? <laughs> because they used up all their energy making you jump. <laughs> I don't know, man. I always thought my spirit animal was a frog, so it might be worth it. <laughs> well, as of about. 15, 20 seconds ago, we are wrapped. Yes. Well, sure. actually, sound's been wrapped for the past 20 minutes or so, but yeah. that's officially a wrap on the set. So, time to start breaking all this down. Yeah. Great, really simple day, honestly. Yeah, pretty much. Because now we just gotta break shit back, or we'll break shit down, get back, and um, unload everything. Hopefully, the elevators will be working this time into, th into 22. And, and uh, with some luck, we'll be back by Josh, Ow. 9, 9.30. Yeah. Well, his name is Danny Mosley. <laughs> and what's gonna take us several hours? I can do an instant. Back to you, Cross. What? Were you gonna say something? No. Okay. Just use the edit, damn it. <laughs> Dan, do you want to do it? Do you want to make the cut? Okay. Yeah. I'll make the cut. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Welcome back. Yeah. Yeah, we're back at U-Cross. Yeah. <laughs> like three hours later. Yeah. Actually, probably yeah. like two hours it's later. It's like two. It's just after nine o'clock. Yes. 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 Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, look what you did now. No. It's hard to film this, Here. No. Stop. Not the cameras. Please, no. Well, we're done for the night. <laughs> yeah, we're done. Goodbye, everybody.